All right, how is it now? Still popping? Still having a pippy pop. Pippity pop. Pop pop pop. Peep pop. Peepo. Perfect. Okay. So, lesson learned. Before I go live, turn OBS off and then on again, and then start streaming. Interesting. Okay. That's weird. That's exactly what happened last time. Exactly what happened, like, literally last Saturday. So weird. But yeah, um, I'm gonna power cycle uh, OBS from now on before I go live. There we go. Got a mid jump. Yeah, so what did I miss last week? Uh, Fingies, you missed... Let's see. You missed me redoing the Seafoam Islands cave. And I actually was smarter this time. Didn't bump into uh, Articuno. Avoided that altogether for later. And uh, got through it, and we got to Cinnabar Island. And uh, on Cinnabar, we went to the town, and the Pokemon uh, gym is closed. It's locked. So, uh, and we found out that we had to go to the Pokemon Mansion and get the key to it. So, we just got the key last stream, and now I'm going to be headed back out right now. ideal for a lab. Look at all this space. Space! Scientist Ivan. Yeah, the rewiring this morning was kind of a chore-ish. Like, I just... My wiring is just a nightmare because there's just too much stuff on my desk. So it took me a long time to do that. Like, I woke up at... Just, like, a little bit before 5 and started it. Like, I had some coffee and started it. And, like, I didn't finish up until, like, 8. Electabuzz is a one-trick pony.
Did I open this? Maybe? Oh, that thief guy I've already... Whoa. Actually, I need the XP. It's huge! front of the console, and it's just doing this. Okay, can we just, like, stay in there? Don't want to waste any more of these? Center, buddy. There we go. Kingler level up. Nice. Kingler became more crabby. That's actually a rather large Pokemon. Not gonna lie, I'd like five foot. Just a little over five feet. That's a big Pokemon. <laughs> Ditto already, but pretty sure I do. Oh, you're gonna bounce around on me like a trash baby. Okay, I get it. No, I'm I'm done. I'm done with that. <laughs> Venusaur, Blastoise is level 50, perfect. 
Kind of wondering when Venusaur is going to learn Solar Beam. saw the jumping Magmar and said, well, ditto. Welcome, Squonky. How you doing? Good morning. Happy Saturday. Doing a little bit of morning Pokemon. Always kind of a highlight of my weekend, actually. I love, I just love Pokemon. I'm still trying to decide... Once we get through Let's Go Pikachu, I'm trying to decide actually like what, which which uh, Pokemon game to do next. Because there's also Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. I mean, not like a conventional Pokemon game, but still. Let's, close, okay. let's keep let's keep the combo going. Pidgeot is level 50. Perfect. Oh, that's right. So we'll go up here, poke the statue one more time. I think that's how we get out. this game, basically, like, you know, the, the more, the higher the combo gets, the more likely that you're to get a, uh, you know, when you catch a Pokemon also. I think experience goes up, too. There we go. First try. Charizard's almost a 50. Besides, I'm pretty sure I have one already. Another combo, maybe? Sweet! Ooh, I'm getting beans! Sweet! There 
we go. There's the level up. Combo five. All right. Maybe I should take on the Cinnabar Gym with just <laughs> all Grimers. <laughs> Oops, all Grimer! <laughs> that would be kind of funny. Kind of. taking on that gym pretty soon. Yeah, here we go. Ooh, three Ultra Balls. Must have been three of the hundred that I literally just threw. but I didn't I, I don't remember seeing this guy. Burglar army. But that's gonna be trouble for my grass Pokemon. Okay, so I've gotta switch out like stat. Blastoise, I choose you. Bubble Beam, let's go! Oh... Ouch! Oh no, my bag of loot! Sorry, buddy. Max Ether. All right. Take it. So many rats. Okay, I gotta get a picture of that. You 
found a peepee -pee up. You put the peepee -pee up in your power up pocket. <laughs> uh, taking a picture because I'm a child. Let's go down. I think that's the right way. Holy crap, that's a... That's... That's a big three, baby. Choose a fifty three. <laughs> Smells so awful it can cause fainting. Through degen through degeneration of its nose, it it lost its sense of smell. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> The actual F. There we go. There we are. Excellent. Not excellent. the gym. Let me get the thing right here. I'm here to sell. What do I have that I can sell? Tons of rare candies. I 
never use these things. Item that prevents stat reduction among the trainer's party Pokemon for five turns after it is used in battle. Increases the critical hit ratio of Pokemon during battle. It can be used only once and wears off if the Pokemon is withdrawn. Yeah. I'm good with that. See you later. I don't ever use these these temporary things. It's just not. I don't know why. It, just, it takes a turn to use it. You know, I'd much rather be use the the strategies. Use the strategery. Increase HP by one. I've never seen speedrunners use X items like those, yeah. I, can, I haven't even I haven't even been using any of these uh, these candies either. Maybe I should. Because I mean stuff like this, it it this permanently increases uh, stats. Medicine that slightly raises the maximum PP of a single selected move that has been learned by a Pokemon. And those are worth 5,000 each. Restores. Ooh, okay, good to know. I can use that on a Pokemon. Though this feather is beautiful, it's just a regular feather feather and has no effect. Interesting. Bonk! PP up is good. <laughs> For casual play, there are moves that either do the same but usually better but usually better effects, okay. I feel like I should hang on to that. A beautiful bottle cap that gives off a silver gleam. Some people are happy to receive that. Interesting. Pretty heart-shaped scale, but it's extremely rare. Some people are happy to receive one. Okay. So those sound like quest items. I need a bunch more Ultra Balls, because apparently going to the Pokemon Mansion exhausted my supply of these. 40 Ultra Balls, yes. To get four premier balls as a bonus. Four premier balls as a treat. That's what I really want to need. Because I need... I needs me to catch a, a Mewtwo.
this place. Snore Lab. I'm Yo, champ in the making. This gym is... Here we go, first question. Interesting. Wait, Mr. Blaine, it's not your turn yet. Oh, that's right. <laughs> er, the old man you just saw here was the gym leader, Blaine. He is a fire-type Pokemon pro. Thank you for that tip. You did well. You did well finding the secret key to get in here. So I think you're ready to take on this gym. As you might have guessed, you'll have to take on a quiz at this gym, as well as battles. Try to have a good time. Interesting. Uh oh, it's it's a game show. Great. Blaine's always thinking up ways to keep the families of the scientists who live here from getting bored. <laughs> Ryu, welcome. Blaine's not very good as an MC, but he is red hot when it comes to battles. There's not too much to get excited about here on Cinnabar Island. No, I'm not ready to So I forgot to do this. As much as I love Pikachu, I mean... I, th I heavily favor, favor uh, Venusaur here, but I'm gonna have to do. Uh, I, I'm gonna die hugely, spectacularly if I uh, if I use Venusaur on with Blaine, and I'm gonna save. Say, ready to start? Yes, I am. No need to be shy, then. Step right up. Here we go. This is the Cinnabar Island Gym Pokemon Quiz. Challengers get asked five questions that they have to answer. Get one right, and you get a Blaine doll. Get a question wrong, and you'll have to battle one of my students here. But if you manage to beat them, then don't worry, you still get a Blaine doll. Think you can collect five Blaine Dolls? Here we go. First question. Which one of these is the Spitfire Pokemon? I think it's Magmar. Yay! Sweet! Congratulations! You won a Blaine Doll! All right, let's move on to the second question. Quiz time. How many gym badges certified by the Pokemon League are here? Oh, our, our, how many badges are there? There are eight. Final judgment is correct. Want another Blaine doll? Cool. We're not done yet. The second question. Hold on, Mr. Blaine. This is the third question. <laughs> the third question. <laughs> a steel type moved move used on a fire type Pokemon would be interesting. Not very effective. Holy heck, thank you so much for the resub! Nine heckin' months. That is 
three quarters of a year, and that blows my mind. That blows my heckin' mind. Nine months. Thank you so much, Andy. It really means a lot. It really means a lot. Congratulations, you won a blame doll. Stream baby, stream baby. <laughs> or sub baby. <laughs> uh, Finkies, thank you so much for that shout out, too. Thank you. The challenger has assembled three blame dolls. On to the fourth question. True or false? TM28 contains the move Tombstone in. False. I mean, like, <laughs> there's Tombstone, but <laughs> not, I've never heard Tombstone-y. I've won another Blame Doll. Okay. I collected four Blame Dolls. It's time for the last question. Challenger Adi, tell me, who are you about to battle? Okay, so there are three correct answers here. Actually, they're all they're all correct. It's blank. Badge, or do I battle the gym? Challenger, you have obtained five blame doubles. Which means it's time for our battle. I'm Blaine, the red hot gym leader here. My fiery Pokemon are all rough and ready with intense heat. They incinerate all challengers. I hope you brought some burn heals. Serious, literally a butthead. We still managed to use bubble. Cam. You're going to face Erica next. Um, actually, <laughs> pushes up glasses. <laughs> Actually, <laughs> Crit. Blaine used Magmar. Arcanine, interesting, okay. No, I'm gonna keep that one. Look at that pretty good boy. The floofer dog. I really, 
I really need to knock out of this. Uh, this one. Uh, are you kidding? That was... That was BS. It's alright. Fire type on fire type. Let's do it. Because this, because Charizard might buy me a bunch of time to uh, <laughs> to res my uh, my, my precious soft boy. by the recoil. Also, thank you. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Ooh, Kingler's a 43 now. Nice. Nine tails. I might be in trouble. Bullshit Gengar with the EV train speed, confusion, hypnosis, dream eater, and one other move I forgot. And one other move I forget, but he'd always use the moves in that order so they'd confuse you, then put you to sleep, then use dream eater to regain any damage you might have gotten in before being put to sleep. And even if you wake up, you're still confused. <laughs> this Gengar almost always went first and was just a pain in the ass to fight. <laughs> I don't think I ever beat it. Oh, that sucks. I think if I can squeeze off one more bubble beam, I'm good. Ha! <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, there we go. Holy heck. How many people had their awakening because of nine tails? I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I shudder to think of it. Not that e nine tails is a great Pokemon. Heckin' awesome. Holy heck. Yeah, many, many furries were uh, born in those years because of that. I have burned down to nothing. Not even ashes remain. 7680 for winning. Nice. You've earned a volcano badge. <laughs> Adi Winrardi Adi XE! <laughs> nice. <laughs> Here, you can have this TM too. Fire Blast. TM46 contains Fire Blast, a red-hot fire-type move. Teach it to a fire-type Pokemon. Vulpix or Charmeleon would be ideal. Fire Blast is an attack to be shown the utmost respect. Don't waste it on water-type Pokemon. Interesting. There we are. Paula, welcome. Nice butt, honey. Oh, I, I, uh, I forgot to do that again. I need to edit that. <laughs> but thank you, I grew it myself. Ah, so this is where you were. I thought you might have made your way to Cinnabar, Cinnabar Island by now. Did you beat playing? Really? Congratulations. Uh, could one of my mods give, uh, give Paula a shout-out? Paula is a good bean. And also... Also give Andy a shout-out, too, if we haven't already. I'm pretty sure we did, but I just want to make sure. Eight gym badges to get into the Thank you, fingies. Okay, perfect. Yeah, I just wanted to, I just wanted to make sure. Andy. I've got seven already, which means that the only one left is. Yeah, it must be the gym in Viridian City, right? It was closed up last time I checked. Though. Have you been to the Viridian City gym yet, Adi? You haven't, right? I guess I'll try stopping by Viridian City one more time. That's the thing, I th I'm still missing... I'm missing more badges than that. Yeah, I've got six badges. No, I've got five badges. And I've got three more to go. I don't even know if I'm doing these in order. Uh, <laughs> Ryu, thank you. Yeah, I have DMs. Yeah, I've never. I haven't even played Devil May Cry at all. Okay, I'm switch up my party a little bit. Pikachu here. You're absolutely not doing them in the right order, but it's great seeing how you explore the world. Yeah, I'm like I was trying to I was trying to go like on the routes in the numerical order, but apparently that's not that's not the correct way. And 
I need to do a burn heal. Actually, you know what? I'm not going to use a burn heal. I'm just going to go to the Pokemon Center. Come on, soft baby. we got to take care of your owies. It's like, I don't know where I should be going at this point. Like, it's been so long since I've played this game that, like... Because, I mean, check it out. Check it out. I've got Brock and Misty, Surge, but then I went to Ninja Dude, and then, uh, and then Blaine. But I don't know who these other three are. Like, I know one is Erica. But then the guy on the bottom, I don't know. And uh, the, the whoever's under Misty, I don't know. It's kind of the fun of Kanto and Johto. You can go way out of order, and it's great. You have at least you have at least seen the other three gyms, two of which are accessible. Okay. I don't know where those gym, gyms are. That's the problem. Town map. Use this item. Okay. So I'm on Cinnabar right now. Okay. Here's the Seafoam Islands. Alright. Pallet Town I've been to. There's no gym there. Viridian City. There's a gym there, but it's closed. Viridian Forest. Okay. Diglett's Cave I've been to. Pewter City. I went to the Pewter City gym, and that's where I think I got Brock's badge. Mount Moon? I don't know if I even went there. Have I been to Mount Moon? I don't, I don't even remember at this point. Route 25. Saffron City I've been to, Celadon City. A power Plant. I know there's a legendary Pokemon there. Rock Tunnel. I think I'm just going to make my way north and see if I can find something here. Actually, what I'm gonna do, what I'm gonna do right now is I am actually gonna make a little pit stop because I have to use the restroom real quick. So let me BRB for just a few minutes here. I will be right back. Enjoy the enjoy this amazing art that Finkies did for me. It's heckin' amazing. I love it. BRB.
All right, I'm back. Thank you all for being patient with me. Too much coffee, and I will just leave it at that. Basically, that pose is like a fail for that. That's right, I forgot. Like, last, uh, the last time I was uh, playing Pokemon, I got a Gyarados. <sighs> Feel the sun and wind. I'll get your sun and wind right here. Nice dab, bro. <laughs> Thank you, Vic. <Vanguard. laughs> Sorry, that's so quiet. I will edit it today. Uh, so, here's something that Artie has been uh, poking me about that I was actually giving it some, like, it's some decent thought. And kind of thinking that since that, mar that gaming marathon is next weekend. <laughs> since that gaming marathon is next weekend. How do you all feel about, a lo uh, I think it's the long drive? So I'm going to be doing Deep Rock Galactic with Tyler for a little while. And then after that, I was thinking about doing uh, the long drive for a long time. 
I heard that game is kind of uh, interesting. <laughs> I know uh, I know Buff Pup had a time had a good time with it a long time ago. Uh, Demi Bun uh, played it recently. I've seen some clips and stuff, and it looks pretty it looks pretty fun and interesting. And I think it would be a good time. Heard of it, but know nothing about it. It should be fun. Yeah. And I'm gonna do some like uh, some like uh, some usual stuff too. Uh, I'm gonna do some Final Fantasy that day. Uh, probably some other stuff too. But, like I've been really wishy-washy on what actually to do. I mean, I just honestly I just want a game for 12 hours and just kind of celebrate the fact that like it's literally going to be a year of streaming. Which still blows my mind. I can't believe I'm doing this right here. Sized gourmet chicken gar garlic from Papa Mojis. I'm gonna cook it before the stream, and like by the end of the stream, it's my goal to have it to have that pizza not exist. Saturday is a Pokemon game for us. Sorry, Stormy. Sorry. Oh, now I'm super. Now I'm super hungry for a pizza. Technique, yes. <laughs> I caught my Pokemon at sea. Davent. <laughs> well, it took that dude long enough, right? <laughs> Slash. 
perfect. squeeze the baby. Do not squeeze the baby. Thank you very much. No squeezy baby. No. Squeezy. Source of fifty four, perfect. He was not easy. What's up, buddy? What's wrong with me swimming? Level 54, sweet. So y'all, uh, does the, uh, does the sound, does it, like, is the sound, like, okay? Is the volume okay on the music and on my mic? Okay, I need to share this Pokemon brain worm to be free. <laughs> Charizard's a 51 now, too. Perfect. Take me down to Celadon City where the girls are green and the grass is pretty. Wow. Music is a touch high. better? And I could be a bit louder. Okay. And Leon's getting larger. Alright. How's that? Perfect. This is going to be easier to do on the fly later once I, have, once I actually have that mixer implemented. I'm going to be working on that today. Better. Perfect. Ah. <laughs> About to send out Onyx. Okay. Yes, I want to switch. Absolutely want to switch. Yeah, that sounds pretty good. Could even pull the sound of the game back a bit more, but mix is better now. Okay, perfect. Yeah, so the, yeah, I mean, I've got the mic arm set up. I have the mic up. I tested the mixer to make sure it worked and all that, and that, it, that works great. Um, but I, now I just need to finalize all the wiring and stuff like that. 
and then uh, I had to go on Etsy of all places to get a shelf because like the way everything is set up like my monitors float like nine inches above my desk and I have a little shelf in front of my main one that I put my stream decks and my keyboard on well my streaming keyboard and my uh, regular keyboard sits underneath it but like with the mixer the mixer is too big for that shelf so I needed to rethink it that that shelf is just gonna take forever to get here. I'll be surprised if I have it by the time uh, the marathon happens. Next week. So okay, let's get. But yeah, that mixer. Oh my gosh, I I almost. I think I mentioned this before. It feels like I I need a college degree. Wow, okay. I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> Alright. Sorry, Onyx. <laughs> Cheap shot. Yeah, you're not wrong, actually. Secret technique, yes. I'm actually gonna do all the rest of these trainers first, and then I will tackle them. Gyarados, a.k.a. Moist Onyx. Ah, oh, Pricklebork, welcome! I always pick up a Pikachu in Viridian Forest, right? See, I started out with Pikachu, so I already had one, but I really wanted a Bulbasaur, so I went to Viridian Forest and got a Bulbasaur. Because Bulbasaurs are amazing and are legit my favorite Pokemon. Absolute favorite. Must protect. Hyper Potion, cool. Is this like yellow version then in that way? Kind of? Yeah, you know what, it is. Think of like, uh, I guess think of Pokemon Yellow, but more in line with... I like the TV show, because it's got Jesse and James in it, and Meowth, and, and that whole thing. I got a big haul. Want to go for it? Fisherman Wade. Alright. 
true yellow version had those more interesting interactions with Team Rocket, okay. Yeah, this is... It's interesting. It's tough to describe because the thing is, like, I played blue multiple times, red multiple times, yellow I played once. And, like, but we're talking, like, almost 20 years ago at this point. Actually, yeah, over 20, 20 years ago. So playing this now is just like, I remember some parts of it, but not a lot. Ah, Dark Wolf, welcome! Hi, Adi, I need to get one of these again. I had Let's Go Eevee, and my daughter stole it when I got her a Switch. <laughs> Dark Wolf, you definitely should. You know, I got this copy at Target, and uh, Target has both versions. And I was just at uh, Fred Meyer. I don't know if you have Fred Meyer where you are, but I was just at Fred Meyer on Thursday and got uh, Link's Awakening and noticed that they still have both of these versions there as well. It's lots of fun. <laughs> I only had blue as a kid. Yeah, I mean, I had blue and I liked it so much and I wanted all the Pokemon. I got red played through red. I got another Game Boy and then just traded back and forth. And then uh, I had this wild idea that I was like, I want a six Pokemon team where three of them are all the original starters. And so I went through the games multiple times just so I could have three of the starters on the team. Yeah, Dark Wolf, you should totally do it. You should totally do it. And for Giggles... I think you should get the Pikachu version, and, uh, you should get the Pikachu version this time. And you could battle your daughter. <laughs> see how she, see how good she is. That would be fun. I know this isn't the most effective way to beat a magic card. Apparently it is the most effective way to beat a magic card. <laughs> Another magic card. Okay. Who can use some experience? I'll do PG Pidgey on. I would trade a bunch between my brother, so one of us could have all three starters. Right on. Carl, welcome! Uh, could I... Uh, if, I have a mo if I have a mob that's uh, uh, in the chat right now, could we shout out Carl? Because Carl is a good bean and also a fantastic artist. I was watching Carl this morning. doing I'll, sh I'll shout out Carl real quick. It's cool. It's Saturday. People are busy. There we go. Thank you, Finkies. It's me, Austin. It's me, Austin. <laughs> Carl, I met through the Alpenheimer's uh, stream, and I believe Carl has done a bunch of art for the Alpenheimer. So yeah, y'all should definitely check out Carl. Give them a follow. Carl's awesome. Just can't say enough good things. Glad I picked up the Gen 1 games for 3DS. Yeah, I could. in hindsight, I wish I had. I wish I had, but I just I didn't. I have a Nintendo DS Lite, but like I never got. I never got a 3DS or any of that stuff. This seems like an unfair fight. Yeah, it it kind of is. That's why I'm not going to use anything other than Quick Attack. still unfair. Time to murder this poor man's fish, right? Her 
I heard Heart Gold and Soul Silver were good for DS. Yeah, we may. I might do. I might do Silver. But the thing is, like, I think I have Pokemon Silver for the actual Game Boy, and I think they re-released for the Switch. I don't know yet. I still have to do a bunch of research. And that's the thing, it's like, I, just, I, I legit don't know what Pokemon game to, uh, to do next after I complete this one. Which I might put up a poll. I might put up a poll in the Discord or something like that. See, Diamond I have. Diamond I have for the DS Lite. It's actually sitting in my DS Lite right now. I had Silver for Game Boy 2, but it's been lost to time. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Just this dude has six Pokemon. Are they all Magikarp? <laughs> They, they are literally all magic art. are in the digital store for Switch. I have Diamond and Pearl somewhere. I had to get both the legendaries. That makes sense to me. That's legit. Yeah, that's, that's the thing. It's like, you know, I'm kind of on the fence about digital copies. Because, like, Xenoblade Chronicles, I have I have as a digital copy. But I was thinking about it. I'm like, what if, like, Nintendo just, like, stops making the Switch able to connect to the internet, you know, and I would kind of lose my games to the ether, right? So it's like, now I'm kind of thinking, it's like, well, maybe I should just get cards to actually have the physical copy. Like, Link's Awakening, Link's Awakening, I played on the, on a, on the original Game Boy, like, the beige one, the spinach green screen. I played Link's Awakening on that, and I had a blast playing it, but never finished it. But I had a blast playing that game, so picking it up for the Switch was awesome. And I thought briefly about doing the digital copy, and I'm like, you know what, no, I'm going to get the physical one, because that's that game means a lot to me. So. And I think I might actually go out and get the physical copy of Xenoblade Chronicles, because that's an awesome game, too. Nope, I'm going to keep battling. That's understandable. That's the reason why I modded my 2DS. Okay. Kind of on the flip side, a physical copy can wear out and stop working. Yeah, that's true. Like, I still have my original blue cartridge, which thankfully, 23 years later, still works. And still has my OG team on it. <laughs> which I have to... I have to... I have to get the wheels going and get getting those Pokemon off there. So need to get Link's Awakening. Love the Zelda games. Yeah, I mean, I highly recommend it. Highly recommend it. I'm going to be playing it pretty soon, uh, streaming also. Yeah, I mean, Brickle, I sort of do. The thing is, though, I mean, I haven't really played it that much. That's the thing. It's like, I went through it, and then just kind of put Pokemon down for 20 years. You know, so that, that, that cartridge has just been, has been stored away. Yeah, my original Zelda is dead. The battery in it died. The old gold cartridge, of course, still can't play really too easy. 
being NES. Yeah, that's the thing. I haven't... I haven't finished that one. I played it. It's great. I mean, I think I might... I might get it for the NES. I have an NES. I might, you know, you'd do a capture card with that or something like that. I haven't decided. I have stuff like Excite Bike. And <laughs> I think that would be fun. Like a hardcore retro stream. I still have my yellow, silver, maybe gold, and crystal cartridges. Nice. Hang on to those. Yeah, we'll air splash it. I'm getting kind of weary of Magikarp City here. Yeah, see, I have my... I. It's not my original NES. Actually, a friend had a pristine NES uh, that I quote-unquote procured. And then I have um, I have an NES that was... Uh, that isn't functional anymore, uh, but that's been gutted, so there's nothing inside of it. It's just the chassis, and I'm, I wanted to make a home theater PC out of that. But I still have to come up with, like, a... I still have to get some proper tools and stuff, because I don't want to cut on that thing and not have the right things to work with. Come on down to the Magikarp City with a... <laughs> NES feeling empty inside, yeah. It is what it is. I mean, that's like it, it's one that has passed on to the to the ether, right? But could still use its empty husk in a respectable manner. Just making sure I got everybody down here. Yeah, I think so. What about this one? The sea cleanses my body and soul, this guy says. And that is literally the cutest emote I have ever seen, Rickleborg. Holy heck. Who did that? Limes. Limealicious. Those are the cutest heckin' Oh my gosh. Oh, artist is Kelly Art. Interesting. Okay. I'm just going to make a note for myself super quick here. Gifted sub from there every once in a while. Aww. That's cool. Ice shard. Uh oh. I forgot. I forgot the, the seal Pokemon rise. Super effective.
Yeah, this is good XP. I'm gonna take on this coach here. But I gotta heal up first. Lucos, welcome! It's nice to see you! Is that going to be good enough? Probably. Make sure PGR is healed up. There we go. That's fine. That's good to go. Ah. I'm going to save real quick. Excellent. Hey you, are you going to Cinnabar Island by any chance? Already been there. I'm bored. Is it okay if I coach you a bit? Yeah, let's do it. My Pokemon will be super serious. More like super serious. Hmm. Coach Trainer Pam, whom I love her hair and I have a crush. I don't miss you, Kim. You get your share. Thank you, Lucos. <laughs> I love her hair. Oh my gosh. Uh oh. Brick break. No, no slap, no, sla no slapping my Pikachu. Thank you very much. There we go. Jinx. Psychic. I'm gonna switch Pokemon. Maybe Charizard. My, my precious, uh, my precious fire daddy. Slapping the Pikachu sounds, what? A <laughs> good Pokemon you made. Aww, no you. Uh oh, bean time. Bean! <laughs> Ultimate reverse card. <laughs> Ice punch. Uh oh. No. Can I put it to sleep? No fair. That was rude. Venusaur melted the ice with its fiery determination. Okay, thank you. That seems cheap, but okay. The 
lips are terrifying, right? Kangaskhan. Hmm. You keep that in. I, what's with the ice punch? Heckin' ice punch. Why is... Why in the world does Kangaskhan have Ice Punch? Why? To protect its precious child. Okay, you're probably not wrong. But still, it's not really... It's not an Ice Pokemon, I don't think. Sleep good. Razor leaf time. No. Trapped in a fiery Voitex. Voitex. And finish it off with a wing attack. Tail club. There we go. And nobody died. Seriously strong, so sick, sick. You're pretty good. I'm gonna give you a little present. Is it ice punch? It's ice punch. <laughs> We just set a new mother on fire. <laughs> Are we the baddies? What? <laughs> oh my god, perfect timing with sick. What? <laughs> TM35 contains ice punch. It's, like, super effective against dragon type and grass type Pokemon. Probably why I had such a hard time with it. I started off with a grass type, and then I moved to a fire, uh, dragon type. <laughs> well, now we know how it got ice punch, right? <laughs> I think I already battled this dude. Can't catch anything good. Not one good Pokemon to be had. That's mean, actually. Magic Carp is good. I seem to only catch Magic Carp. You don't say. I think that's it. And here's Pallet Town. I'm raising Pokemon too. When they get strong, they'll be able to protect me. Shh. 
shades of your journey awaits. <laughs> Mom. Why, look at you, Adi. I think you need a little rest. Now that's much better. You and your Pokemon look full of energy. This place. Good to see you. How is your Pokedex coming along? Here, let me take a look. 126 Pokemon seen, 67 caught. Ho ho, this is turning into quite the respectable Pokedex, I'd say. Nice. Alright, alright, alright. I still I need to keep heading north here. They actually did a really good job with the music. Good old Pallet Town. I like that Gen 2 had twice the content uh, Gen 1 had. Ah, uh, I. Th no, ah, uh, I think it did? Why is this pool here? Last voice is happily staring at the water surface. Precious soft baby. have dozed off in the sun. I had this weird dream. A lost spirit became a flame and was floating around. Why is everything blurry? Hmm? Seems I picked up this TM without realizing. Eek, that's creepy. I'd better give it to you. A will-o'-wisp. Interesting. Twenty-two, I believe, is. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what goes to the final four. Yo, there, kid from Pallet Town. finding all the places I couldn't go to before I had all these special moves. Wow, okay. What? <laughs> Two regions to explore. Hmm. I should load up the first couple gens on 2DS to get my feel for Pokemon back. You absolutely should. Absolutely should. I love po Pokemon so heckin' much. Let's 
super potion. Nice. A leaf stone. Interesting. Secret techniques are so cool, aren't they? So, race has been postponed. Interesting. What's going on? I wonder why they postponed it. I played, I played enough Pokemon to get through caves without Flash. It's not really a big deal, though. It is kind of a big deal, though, because, like, that's really difficult to do. Can you use them? CP stands for combat power. Whoa! Combat! Nope, I... Definitely think I have not been through here. What's this place? Now, use secret techniques to your heart's content. Since they're not moves, you can use them even if your Pokemon doesn't have the energy to battle. Interesting. You could get through the rock tunnel if you use the secret technique light up. Do you know where the rock tunnel is? You'll find it if you head east from Cerulean City. I think I've been... Have I been through the rock tunnel? Pretty sure I have. There's Diglett's Cave. Okay. There is something back here. Not really something I can use, though. I've heard that there's a tunnel even darker inside this than this one somewhere, somewhere out there. Tons of little diglets. Diglet dig, diglet dig, diglet dig. a obscenely diagonal cave. Adi, I have to leave for a little bit. Uh, I hope I can come back in a short while. Okay. Take care, Lucos. Thank you for stopping in, and I hope to see you, uh, hope to see you in a little bit. Dark cave and then nothing but fucking Zubats, right? <laughs> well, I'll be. Did you know this huge, long tunnel? If it was dug entirely by Diglett. Vermilion 
city. Okay, this is where Lieutenant Surge is. Rip and tear until it is done. Mm, stretch. I wonder why that I wonder why that race for Paula is postponed. That's weird. partner ducks here are going to go catch a Spiro soon. Nice. You got anything in your fridge? Do you have any games on your phone? Nice butt, buddy. Thank you, Ryu. I grew it myself. <laughs> So the SSN departing? I guess she'll be back in Vermilion Port about this time next year. How is Squirtle? Uh, Squirtle is a Blastoise now. Uh, <laughs> ah, Meowpenheimer, welcome! Uh, could one of my mods in the chat uh, give a shout-out to Meowpenheimer here? Meowpenheimer is probably one of the most entertaining streamers I have found lately. Holy heck. It's so much fun. <laughs> Uh, that emote just screams. Ah! <laughs> Thank you, Ryu. Yeah, meow. Meowpy is a good, 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 good bean. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> you know what else screams that? <laughs> So Meowpy, interesting, interesting little fact. So this morning, the crackly audio is back. So it has, it, it, it literally has to be, it has to be something with my capture card. Mode. Because I, uh, I, I, I restarted OBS and it was gone. I don't know why that is. Super weird. Ryu from Street Fighter sitting on a bench. He's probably he's probably he's he's waiting for his Ken. Ryu's <laughs> Ryu's allowed to have a day off. You were certainly right, Digital Deer. You are correct. 
Ryu's can have the day off once in a while as a treat. trainers I have fought already very early but I didn't notice this here before A super potion nice always use that I work in healthcare so I don't get days off <laughs> If the Pokemon you're walking with suddenly stops as if it's surprised, that means it's found an item for you. Oh, you're that kid. Thanks again for before. You're welcome. Saffron City. Silco under our control, we can sell Pokemon for profit all around the world. We'll get stinking rich. Yeehaw! Dirtbag. Here's the Mart. I don't really need to buy anything right now. That's a tunnel. So what we're going to do is I'm going to consult the Maparu. Yeah, there we are. Perfect. That's really weird. Like, how did I... Lavender Town. Okay, there's the rock tunnel. Okay, I'm gonna make my... I'm gonna make my way to Lavender Town and just check to make sure I haven't been... Pretty sure I've been to the rock tunnel, but I guess we'll see. Also, Ryu, I had no idea you worked in healthcare. Bodies have rock tunnels once in a while as a treat. Uh, okay, I just keep heading north. I'm on the right track. Perfect. Yeah, I do home health care, go to people's homes and help them out. Worked in memory care before that, and a group home before that, over the past 15 years. Wow. Secret technique light up, yes. Whoa! 
That was a surprise. Yeah, I've been, I'm pretty sure I've been here. Yeah, I've already fought all these trainers. Yeah, I've been here before, all right. Gosh, where are these other gyms that I'm supposed to go to? Why can't I remember this? Bonk. Jigglypuff and your floaty garbage. No, I don't want that. One of the things that kind of drives me a little nuts about this game is if you shake the controller just right, you get a play or two that pops up. Even if you don't want it. There we go. That's an animation I've never seen before. We teamed up. Me and me. We both cut <laughs> a jinkly buff. can have some food as a treat. Oh, 
Uh, I can't stop talking. I can't stop thinking about pizza. Are these other three gems? Saladon City. I will go this way. Blastoise found something? Ooh. A berry, nice. Starting to get really low on berries. It's a gym over in Celadon City. Do you plan on going? I think I've already been there, pretty sure. talk to before. Hello there. I've been watching you walk right past me this whole time, and I was hoping you'd come to visit me someday. I was really lonely. Why did I make a pond right in front of my house? Just going for a walk is troublesome. I was so short-sighted when I was young. I was so stupid, stupid, stupid. I was such an idiot. Whew. Sorry for my toxic mental. But I feel better now. So I'll give you a TM. Poison jab. Okay. Interesting. Yeah, it is a little creepy, isn't it? vehicle with a bunch of balloons attached to it. Oh, you're curious, aren't you? You're curious about me and this machine? Do you want to know the details? Yes. If you insist, if you insist, this machine is a great vehicle that allows you to fly in the sky. It's a marvelous invention, if I do say so myself. It's not an exaggeration to say that it, this is a secret technique. Ooh. Even though I worked really hard on this, nobody wants to try it. You seem to be a courageous young girl. I'll tell you how to ride this machine, the secret technique Sky Dash. Oh, that Pikachu wants to fly my invention instead of you? Great, it matches my inspiration perfectly. All right, let's get right to it. Do this and that, hold this handle and pull. Then that will be like that. And with these balloons, you're in the air. Sweet! Use the secret technique Sky Dash and you can fly to a town you've been to. Select Play with Pikachu in the main menu and select Secret Techniques. Okay. You can have this machine, so be sure to enjoy many trips through the sky. Hmm. Okay.
been to Pewter City. Cerulean City. I think Viridian City is where that other gym is. Pallet Town. Fuchsia City. <laughs> there we go. That used to be named Fly, if I'm not mistaken. Ah, uh, yes, here's the gym. Viridian City Pokemon Gym. Ooh, it doesn't say it's closed anymore. Mock type. What? Pokemon gym is always closed. I wonder who the gym leader is. Just wandering around with your Pokemon can be so much fun. But you already know that, right? What the heck? Go do the power plant? Ah, uh, yeah, I could. Ugh. The thing is, like, I'm trying to figure out, like, what the next gym I'm supposed to go to is. Because I think Cerulean City was misty. There's no gym in Lavender Town. It's just at Saffron. Vermilion City, that's where Surge is, if I'm not mistaken. Fuchsia City is where that uh, the ninja guy is. Cinnabar, I, I literally just did. No pallet down. That's where it just was. Places you've been. Okay. Hmm. Just give me a sec here. So if I asked for a clue, is there anybody in chat who would be willing to give me a clue, or are y'all just gonna watch me suffer? <laughs> just doing a video switch. can absolutely tell you. Okay, Fingies, l l lay it on me.
my memory is terrible and like I I'm more concerned with uh, remaining entertaining right now than like wandering around a Pokemon going Ugh. I just walk around the city while look out. All right, fair enough. Enough of all that stuff. Okay. I don't remember if there is a gym here or not. I thought there was. Oh, there is. Okay. Don't think you can stand up to us or I'll have to hurt you. Okay, so there's a gym right here and I can't, I can't get into it. I already fought that guy, the fighting the fighting Pokemon guy. Yeah, Saffron Saffron City Pokemon Gym, Gym Leader Sabrina. Master of Psychic Pokemon, okay. But what do I do to get into there? Yeah, I did do Sylph. I'm not sure why they're here. This also might be something that might have to wait until next uh, the next Pokemon stream, because we're kind of getting to the point where we should think about maybe raiding somebody. You know, as a treat. Hmm. Is that it? Do you think do you think that's it, Ryu? Like we have to take care of them at the power plant and then come back here? That would be interesting, and also not something I remember from Pokemon uh, Pokemon Blue or Red or Yellow when I was doing it. Hmm. What? Pikachu lost its balance. It seems uneasy now. What? That's what I'm thinking, since I believe you were supposed to do that earlier. Let's go to Lavender, and I'll go north. Let's see if I can get to that power plant. How 
do I get to the power plant? That's the thing. Yeah, because there's the power plant right there. Here's Lavender. Rock Tunnel. Okay. Through the cave? Uh, maybe? I just remember the rock tunnel going somewhere else, not necessarily to the power plant. have a Kangaskhan yet. Come on, jump back one. Jump back. Damn it. There we are. Nice. You got a master ball, didn't you? I'm still lost on why the rocket grunts are still there. I just looked, I just, honestly, I just looked at my inventory and there was no master ball there. Which I'm pretty sure I was supposed to get at Silphco. But... Super Potion, perfect. Oh, so you still need to do Sylph, I think. Okay, I did Rocket Headquarters. Oh, I didn't do Sylph. That's why. Because I got the Sylph scope from Giovanni at the Team Rocket hideout. But I didn't do Sylph Co. itself. That's what I have to do. Now I just have to remember where it is, to be honest. Yeah, I'm gonna check out I'm gonna check out Power Plant anyway. I'm just trying to figure out where it even is. Well I know where it is, but how to get to it is a different matter. this
Stay. 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 Oh, another thing I was I managed to actually do today. I created a Twitch account. I created a second Twitch account to do all of my testing. So y'all won't be pinged when I'm doing a stream tests and stuff like that. Ah, Faultyvi, welcome! Long time no see. Good bean, how are you doing? circles now. Doing laps. Uh, also, uh, if I have any mods watching right now, I think there's fing Fingies and Ryu right now. Uh, could either one of you, or both, actually, <laughs> if you want, uh, can you give uh, Faulty Vi a shout-out? I, uh, work's been crazy. Another cyber attack knocked out the whole server company. Oh, heck. That doesn't sound good. Work's been, uh, work's been pretty crazy for me, too. Not anything cyber attack related, but, like, we, uh, we do support for lots of schools, and, uh, for some reason, like we like uh, the RMA rate for Chromebooks has been kind of for schools and stuff, so we've been taking care of that. We had some, I had some mandatory overtime like a week or two ago, which wasn't fun. And girlfriend got COVID, so I've been doing her duty. But you're 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 staying safe yourself, right? Hopefully. Blastoise is level 52. Perfect. I did get four of my monitors all set up again. Need to clean my stream desk because I've been wanting to do a build stream. Maybe Legos this time. Ooh, I'm here for that. Heck yeah. Please let me know when you're planning on doing that, and I I want to make sure that I can be there. That sounds amazing. I feel okay. I just got a booster a few weeks ago, and I'm pretty protected. Good. Just get a GBA to USB uh, cart reader. Dumped my fire red cart. I keep getting attacked. Oh my gosh. There we go. I still need to check if it worked. Yeah. Heck. I need to do something similar because I got—I still have my OG Pokemon team on my put my blue cart. <laughs> I need to figure that out. Anyone else ever press a button to the ball? Any 
react. Anyone else ever press a button to the ball pulses thinking it helped with... Yeah. <laughs> uh... No, not yet. I've got so many hours in Pokemon games. Yeah, I kind of mash A right now. Like, whenever I'm just doing really anything. I'm trying not to with uh, with my Switch Joy-Cons, though, because the... Uh, I don't want to destroy something, or I have to buy, like, new... new controllers because of all the thumbstick drift and things like that. I think it's a nice touch that all of these, all the all these crabbies, <laughs> they walk sideways. It's probably about that time for me, though. Let's see. I think I'm gonna raid. I haven't fully beat a Pokemon title since Black and White. I have. I haven't played Black and White. That's something else I need to do. I just don't know if I can get that for Switch. No, get away! Get away, you creepy boy! Okay. Cool. whole generation by its Japanese Romanized names. Hmm. Arctic I Arctic I rated not long ago. Proxy, but I don't know how much longer she's going to be going. Andy, can you do me a huge favor? If you're still watching. Doryuzu and Exile. Oh, I see. I wanna. I, w I would like him to ninja find out if Proxy is going to be wrapping up or, or wrapping up soon. Let's see. Being sneaky. 
Stick with me, folks. I'm getting a reply from Andy. Well, I still might anyway. Yeah, I mean, let's do it. So, like, a dear friend, Proxy Glitchcat, is playing, uh, let's see. She's playing uh, Shin, Megami, Shin Megami Tensei Devil Survivor. You now, Proxy is actually does a lot with, uh, like, different console games and a lot of handheld stuff that you don't typically see anywhere else. She's fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. And actually one of the one of the first streamers that I had followed uh, when I started getting into Twitch. Like, started to seriously get into Twitch. Ah! <laughs> so, yeah, let's do that. Proxy Twitch cat. Cool. So, I'd appreciate it if y'all would stick around for the raid, because Proxy has raided me uh, on weekends more times than I can really count. She's uh, super cool and super nice. I think y'all will love her. But that's going to be it for me. I really need to get some lunch in me, because I am, like, shaky hungry. And I haven't had breakfast yet, either. Only coffee. <laughs> so... Right on. Let's pop on over there. Uh, thank you all so much for coming by. You're amazing. Uh, the next time I'm going to be streaming is tonight, 6 p.m. PST. I'm going to be doing Final Fantasy XIV mainly, but I do kind of want to finish up I Love You, Colonel Sanders. I've just got a tiny slice of that game left. So, yeah, look for that. So I'm gonna, I might, I might finish that, and then we'll head on right into Final Fantasy XIV. But uh, that's going to be it for me. I hopefully will see you tonight, 6 p.m. Take care, folks. Have a great, great day. And see you tonight.